So basically what you want to do, download yourself a metronome of some kind and say it so that it's 100 beats per minute. And it should sound like this. So that should be 0 0.6 seconds, which is a game tick. So I'm doing a lot more mobile Inferno at the moment. Um, and uh, at the maximum I've managed to get to is about wave 47, uh, whereas on PC I've got to about wave 56, and I think that's mostly down to uh, being able to flick more effectively. So I'm going to do a little bit of experimenting now. Um, I'm going to find out if I can uh, do one tick and uh, two tick blob flicks, at, at least to a relatively passable degree. I'm sure that I'll fat finger some stuff, but it is what it is. So, uh, I'm going to be using the metronome that I talked about earlier. Uh, obviously, I've not got it on now because it's really obnoxious when you're recording. It just makes a horrendous sound. I've already recorded loads of footage and I'm going to have to redo it because there's just this massive knocking sound constantly. Um, so just so you're aware of that. The test to see how loud and obnoxious the metronome sound is. And, uh, this is me talking with a little bit more gusto to see if that actually helps. And I will be using the um, metronome, so at certain times in the video I'm going to turn that on. So it's just a fair warning, there's going to be a loud knocking noise. It's kind of annoying, but it's 100 beats per minute, so it's it's just so that I can be doing the flicks effectively and show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. So obviously the most simple thing to do on mobile, the most simple flick, is the lazy flick. With blobs, once they've seen you, just switch to the other style. And then after a tick, switch to the other, or a couple of ticks, to switch to the other style. Once they've hit you, so the attack hits, wait a couple of seconds, switch. And then if you're far away, then you switch as soon as the attack lands. All of this information is available already. This is just a recap. There you go, so far away, switch when it lands. And when you're closer, wait a tick. Wait a couple of seconds, switch. Take no damage. Okay, so the next most simple one, uh, probably either one tick flicking or two tick blogs, depending on uh, how you feel comfortable. So for this I'm going to turn the metronome on, I'm just letting you know there's going to be a bit of an obnoxious clicking sound. There we go. I've got the volume as low as I can on this metronome. Right. So I've set that to 100 beats per minute, so every clicking noise is a tick. So once the blob sees you switch, and then when the attack lands, I'm going to start two ticking. One, two, one, two, two, one, two. Every second tick, switching styles. So that's a two tick blob flick, that's all good. As you can see, that works on mobile, all good. But what do you do when you come to eat? Because you can easily walk between the flicks. but you need to eat something. So I'm going to use a prayer potion. So you've got to get the timing right here. On mobile, you can use your hotkeys. So I've currently got my hotkey set to mage, I think. So the tick that I am switching to range, I need to activate my hotkey. Okay, so I've taken an attack there, so I just have to wait for more tick. There we go, and we're flicking. Right, so. How to eat two tick pod flick. Switch, eat, activate prayer, and then. It's quite hard to explain and do it at the same time. But I'll show you again. Switch, eat, activate. 
So if you've already activated your quick there, you have to double click it. If it's not activated, you can single click it. This is a bit complicated, it's going to take you some practice. But it works. Let's try it again. Beep, beep. Double click. That's good. See? Now, I have to wait an extra click there. I'll turn the metronome off. I'm going to try and do this next bit without it because it is quite loud. So I'm going to try one tick clicking now. So just switch and the second that Bob tacks, I'm going to start one ticking. Tick, 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 tick. Switch in styles at every tick, which is 0 0.6 seconds. And you can just get the timing down with the metronome. Now something that's really powerful uh, with mobile is that you can use your other thumb. So while you're flicking, you can move around. Oops, I lost a tick there, but it seemed to be okay. So you can move around, keep your, your flicks going with your left thumb. and keep walking. And you can also use this to attack as long as you keep your prayers going and don't miss click like I just did. So you can completely keep your defenses up. Now you've got to not forget about your left thumb, it's the only problem. So it takes a bit of practice, but that, if, if you get the practice down, that can be really powerful. So I'm going to practice this against multiple NPCs now and see if I can pull it off. So I'm going to try these mechanics out on the new UI as well, just to see what the crack is. So, start off trying to kill that nibbler. So we're one tick flicking here. We managed while well, one tick flicking to run all the way across the arena and kill that nibbler and get safely behind the pillar. Now I'm gonna let the blob hit me for a attack so that I've got some uh, health that needs healing. And I'm gonna try and eat. So let's test this out on the new UI and see what happens. So one, two, one, two. Shit. And 
and double flick, flick. So this is harder, in my personal opinion, on the new UI, but that might just be muscle memory. Two, one, two. Two, three. Yep, so I'm set up again. Okay, I'm going to try just using my right thumb. Eight. Okay. Again, if you've got the metronome on, this might be a little bit easier as well. Eat, double click, switch. See ya. It's doable, but it's difficult. Personally found it easier with the old system. Losing ticks. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one. Yeah, so it's doable. You just got to get your head around it. One, two, one. Two, one, two. Yep. That was too fast there. Perfect, so I've set up my two tick blob flick again, and with my left thumb I was able to attack the blob, and then I'm going to just one tick flick. Kill these guys off, and a misclick there. I don't know, with practice I think it'll work. It's far more difficult than on PC obviously, but it is doable. Try it all out with a little bit of carnage involved. Missing tick somewhere. 